What is steering in Doppler ultrasound? At an angle of 90 degrees, as in this case or in this orientation, there is no relative movement of the target towards or away from the transducer. So the value here or change in frequency will be unchanged and no Doppler shift is detected. In addition, the value here will be zero Hence, we will not be able to get the velocity. So what we do is to send the pulse at an angle, just like this. And what is usually available is we can adjust the angle to 20 degrees or minus 20 degrees. These pulses are parallel to the steering boxes that we see. The pulses are parallel to the boxes we see. And these boxes help us visualize the angle of the beam. If you notice here, even though that we adjusted the beam, the angle is less than 90 but still does not reach the 60 degree angle that we want. Well, in reality, the vessels are not perfectly parallel as drawn here. They are usually at an angle just like this. Notice now that the 60 degree angle is now obtained with the help of the steering of the beam. If we place an incorrect angle of the steering box, note that the Doppler angle here is large and is more than 60 degrees. Hence, this will get us an inaccurate measurement of the velocity. Applying it to actual images, here we see a small angle, which is good, while here, in an incorrectly placed steering box, we have a large angle, which is more than 60 degrees and hence not ideal. So what is steering? So steering allows us to direct the ultrasound beam at an angle in order for us to get the optimal Doppler angle. Thank you for listening.